The end of season two of Cobra Kai saw John Kreese stealing the dojo away from Johnny Lawrence. He'd already been trying to bring Cobra Kai back to its old, more brutal ways, which led some of its pupils to quit and join Miyagi-Do. But with Daniel shutting that down and Kreese keeping his most fanatical students going into season three, it's very possible that some of Sensei Lawrence's former pupils could side with him if and when he decides to fight back. I'm Greg Elliott with Screen Rant, and here are all the characters who previously bailed on Cobra Kai and might side with Johnny in season three. If I'm extra hard on you, it's only because you have the potential to be better than I ever was. Yes, Sensei. Miguel's loyalty is obviously to Sensei Lawrence, and had he not been nearly killed, he probably would have walked out with Johnny when Kreese stole the dojo out from under him. And with Johnny personally taking on Miguel's rehab and training, we're sure that Miguel will be right by his side and may very well be able to sway other Cobra Kai's who don't necessarily agree with Kreese's methods. Chris joined Cobra Kai in Season 2 with his buddy Mitch, but the two had a falling out when Chris switched over to Miyagi-Do. Mitch went all in on Chris's no mercy philosophy, but that didn't sit right with Chris. And while he did beat Mitch at the Big West Valley High fight, with Miyagi-Do now closed, he could now join up with Johnny if he still wants to pursue karate. Who's badass now? Against all odds, Dimitri managed to beat his former best friend Hawk in the big brawl, but before Dimitri reluctantly joined Miyagi-Do, he did first try to get in with Cobra Kai, but wasn't able or willing to perform any of the physical aspects of learning karate. But getting one over on Hawk might have given him some new confidence, and he might decide to give training under Johnny another chance in Season 3. And Nathaniel, one of the youngest kids in the show, also left Kreese's dojo and joined Miyagi-Do while his best friend Bert stuck with the black and yellow. Their standoff during the season two finale ended with a stalemate as security got involved, but like Chris, with Miyagi-Do shut down, Nathaniel could also decide to follow Johnny if and when he opens up a new dojo. You're not afraid of these losers, are you? No. Good, because when I'm done with you, you're gonna be sending a message back. Only it's not gonna be with your keyboard. It's gonna be with your fists. Aisha was Cobra Kai's first female student, and she's still loyal to Johnny. She was already having doubts about Kreese, and her loyalty was torn since she was still friends with Sam and Tori. Now, Nicole Brown will not actually be back in season three, so it's currently unclear how Aisha will be written out of the show. Although, given her wealthy parents, it's possible that they might just pull her out of West Valley High. But if Aisha does return in Cobra Kai in season four, expect her to join back up with Johnny if she wants to continue her training. Most characters in the Karate Kid and Cobra Kai franchise have been members of Cobra Kai at one point or another, including Daniel. But the season two finale threw everything up in the air and season three definitely looks to be upping the stakes with Kreese's takeover of the dojo. We know that Chosen Taguchi and Kumiko will be back this season and there's still a solid chance that Johnny and Daniel's old girlfriend Allie will show up at some point. So make sure to keep coming back to Screen Rent as we strike first and strike hard with all your Cobra Kai news. I'm Greg Elliott, thanks for watching, and I'm out. Peace.